everybody, Jess Santi here, and we're going to be looking at another bust. This time we're going to be looking at, from the Amazing Spider-Man collection, the Scarlet Edition. And here we have Scarlet Spider. Now, back history. Scarlet Spider is actually Ben Riley, one of Peter Parker's many clones during the Clone Saga. Though he actually turned out good, and not evil. Alright. In the Clone Saga, towards the end... It was hinted that Ben Riley here was actually was not a clone, but Peter himself was in fact the clone. Yeah. Um. Pete, when Peter found out, actually when they both found this out, Peter was very distraught and decided to take a break of being Spider-Man and just spend time with his wife. So that's what he did, and Ben Riley promised Peter that. Uh, as he's gone, he'll take over the mantle of Spider-Man. So, that he did. He, at first, had a costume similar to Peter's, but decided to change his own, to give him his, himself his own look, and called himself Scarlet Spider. Alright, so, in the comics, he has, from what I, I think I remember, he had joined the New Warriors, and... Um, was invited to become part of the Avengers. Though, I guess that never worked out. Alright. So, his last appearance was, I believe, I don't know the exact issue, but Peter Parker came back, and I'm not sure who the villain is they were fighting. I think it was the Green Goblin, I'm not sure. But, in the end, Ben Riley sacrifices himself to save Peter and as once he dies his body turns into dust thus concluding that and Peter concluding that Ben was actually the clone all along though Peter um, thought of him as a brother and in his last words he says goodbye my brother I believe there was something like that alright so there you go that's the end of storyline that's the end of character alright let's take a look at the bust itself First, take a look at the box. I guess I'm going to be doing this from now on, join the box. Alright, the box is it's a pretty small box. See here, it says Amazing Spider-Man Scarlet Edition. It's a Scarlet Spider. It's a minibus by Marvel. Here's a little... Shows the comic books right here. And a little backstory, but you can't you probably can't read that. So, as I said, look it up to find more of his history. So there you go. Here's another side. You probably can't read it. It's uh, six feet tall. I mean, six inches tall. Fully painted. Red foot display. Strictly limited. It was sculpted by Brandy Bowen and Bruno Botillo. And if you want to know, this is by Bowen Designs. And my opinion, Bowen, I like their statues. All right. Now let's get take a look at this guy. It's himself. Alright, so you see his colors. You know, I'm not even going to go to the description. But, I really like the colors. Alright, you see the little stand he's on. Not sure what that is. I guess it's a, um, assuming it's a building. But it's very detailed. You know, and then you can see his belt. Pretty cool. And you see his hoodie. Yeah, I really like the hoodie. It's really cool. You see all the waving lines, and you see the spider symbol, and the fact that the hood itself is covering the part of the spider. You know, I really like that. And you see a little gap in here. Basically, you can see his um, web shooters, and the muscle detail is very, very nice. It probably is hard to see it, but the detail is really amazing. I really like it. Alright, so... I got this guy in my local comic book shop. So if you see him in your comic book sh shop that you go to, I say pick him up. He's a, he's a decent size. He's not overly big like on um, Battery Bill. You know, but he's kind of small. But you know what? I like him. I like him very much. So I would say pick him up if you ever, if, if you ever see him. So, alright, this is my second bust review, and I am signing off.